Ready. They start the drive with Peterson. And he'll be taken down, but not. Like you lost another one. Today we're going to break down the best way to attack meta defenses in Madden 24 using what I like to call a six or seven strong front. So what I like to do is I like to have two tight ends on the field and two wide receivers on the field. If your opponent does not match personnel, it's going to be big chunk yardage every single time. Now, every play that I am running is down in my ebook. If you are interested in that, make sure that you go in the link in the description or check out the pinned comment in the comment section. Now, how you can beat 6 1 meta very easy is to hit your opponent with underneath routes and then the wide receivers on the same type of concept. Okay? So, let's say you have two wide receivers to the left. There's usually a five yard purple by both of the linebackers at the line of scrimmage and then 25 or 30 yard clouds by the cornerbacks okay now the user is responsible for all the middle of the field where you can see me right there throwing a dot with the playmaker so something as simple as a curl roll on the left side a flat on the left side and then a flat on the right side the running back on a check and release going up the middle that right there will put the user in a bind. Now, what's good about my scheme is I have runs to the right, pitches to the right, runs up the middle, runs to the left, pitches to the left. So my opponent can't shift his line to one side because then I can run to the opposite side. So as you can see, flat route, my old icon is on a hitch. My tight end is on a hitch. My running back is delayed. So he's going to pull down the clouds. He's going to pull down the purples. Now the user is running off to the old icon. I see that. Throw it to the opposite person. Okay? It's that simple. Now when they start switching it up, they're going to start cross manning people. As you can see right here, underneath, we have the running back. To the outside, because the purple didn't get out there, we have the other route. Now, looking at that end, that's a purple route. This time, he blitzed them. So, once he blitzed them, hit them with an RPO. He had a good block shed, but we got four yards. Once I see that, I like that defense. I'm going to keep you in it. Those adjustments that you just had on the field, I'm going to force you to keep them adjustments. Motion somebody over. Now, we can pitch it or keep it with the quarterback. Third and four, keep them adjustments on the field. Once they have 5 yards purple, 25 yard clouds, they are stuck with them adjustments. Unless they reset the play, then that's going to put them in normal drops. Okay, so we have the underneath from the running back. We have the curl on the other side. This time he cross man the person over there. And with this scheme, I have 2 to 3 routes every single time. And as you can see, the middle of the field is wide open. So, instead of me having read number one or read number two, in my ebook, I show you how to go through three to four different reads. Now, right here, if they are playing man coverage with the best players in the game, pressing you at the line of scrimmage, you're going to be able to bomb them over the top. Easy, easy way to beat every defense. Dollar, run on them. 6-1, run on them. Once they get less aggressive, pass on them. Dot down the middle. Dot out the backfield, dot on the sidelines, dot, 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 cheat code offense. Let's go. And he's out of bounds. Almost. First down, here's a run with Peterson. And down in. Set up very well for the rest of the drive. Second down, Peterson again. And he takes it in. Touch. Vic goes play action. 
Give him 32 on the post route because it's a little bit longer developing play. And that's... And he is in 